story to tell. According to a report from the press service of the Central Military District in December 2020, the first batch of support vehicle tanks, BMPT Terminator, entered the tank division of the Central Military District. Accordingly, eight BMPTs entered the 90 Panzer Division, stationed in the Jabilinsk region for a trial operation. Currently, the farm crews are undergoing retraining to work on new equipment. They are assisted by representatives of UVC. The Russian Defense Ministry announced recently that the trial phase with the Terminator tank support fighting vehicle has been completed. During the evaluation process from the end of 2020, the combat crews have completed all the tests on techniques, combat tactics, and fire attacks on simulated targets, along with attacking multiple ground targets. In these tests, the Terminator BMPT was also tested against low-altitude air targets and proved to be amazingly effective. Before the test was completed in Russia, the Terminator vehicle also successfully completed its mission in operations to attack rebels in Syria. Terminator has the ability to track three targets at a time. It is known that in Syria's Dear Israel Battlefield in 2017, the Terminator entered the war for the first time and showed its impressive strength. Here, the Terminators were fitted with soft armor blocks. According to the Center for Analysis of Strategies and Technologies, Russia, or CAST, the Russian version of Terminator sent to Syria has many special features. The vehicle used the original heart of the BMPT with a combination of two 30mm AG-17D automatic grenade launchers. But the turret was taken from the more modern BMPT-72. In addition, Terminator vehicles participating in the battle of DEZOR also did not have thermal image sensors for the commander, but only an optical reconnaissance device. This significantly reduced the cost of the vehicle, but did not affect the ability to fight effectively in the Syrian battlefield. Not only that, the soft armor mounted on the side of the vehicle also limits the damage to relics explosive reactive armor during battle. Statistics from Russian forces in Syria said that in just over a month of combat, these Terminators destroyed more than 30 military vehicles demolished some buildings as rebel bases. The Terminator was equipped with Ataka anti-tank guided missiles, capable of hitting targets at a distance of 6 kilometers. The Terminator also has two 30mm 2A42 auto cannons, two grenade launchers, and one 7.62mm machine gun. Terminator can reach a top speed of 60 km per hour. The Ataka missile has supersonic speed, laser guided, for a very high ability to destroy targets. The enemy has 
absolutely no chance of escaping or using containment equipment after the missile is launched. The attacker missile warhead is capable of penetrating 800mm armor, and the thermal warhead, when exploded, gives the same explosive effect as the 152mm high explosive fragmentation warhead. The attacker missile has a variety of warheads, giving the Terminator the ability to destroy all targets, such as mountain tanks, heavy armor vehicles, today and in the near future. The Terminator is relatively heavy, about 47 tons, about half a ton more than the T-90S but very maneuverable. The vehicle is fitted with a DSR engine V92S, producing 1000 horsepower. This is an engine that is rated for its very high reliability and fuel efficiency. The vehicle's main weapon is mounted on a low-profile turret, fitted with composite armor with a large angle, along with active explosive reactive armor panels. Terminator can destroy targets on buildings, on steep high points, and can attack low-flying air targets. With its equipment package, the Terminator can destroy any tank and is a nightmare for low-altitude air targets like helicopters, UAVs, or low-flying attack aircraft. My video about Russian BMPT Terminator answer. Thank you for watching. If you find this video interesting, please give me your thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to support the channel. Goodbye and see you again in the next videos.